Hi everybody, it's Carmen with a little time out for me. It's been a while, so I thought I would, um, it's just been really busy crazy, and now here we are in the bright little thick of the holidays, and I thought I would um, do a Dollar Tree haul today and have you help me build a basket. So what I'm doing is, it, one of our traditions is we create goodie baskets for our kids' birthday. And so I had gone out tonight and picked up some things for her basket. And it's usually treats. It's almost like a stocking. And her birthday is very close to Christmas. And she's almost supposed to be born the day after Christmas. But um, it's at the beginning of December. So I'm making this basket for her and with some of her favorite treats. And then I got some other things too. So I thought I would share in the haul. So, a lot of good uh, food goodies and some other cute little finds that I found there that I thought would be cute to stick in her little goodie basket. And things for Christmas, too. So, a lot of food in this haul. There's also some yarn towards the end. So, um, here's the first thing. I got her some, it's going to be totally random. It's, I'm just pulling things out. Uh, these very fine juice boxes of fruit punch. Like those little drinks. I found these Russell Stover packs of candy. This is pretty nice. It's um, three pieces, a milk chocolate truffle, a dark chocolate truffle, and a pecan delight. They also have the bags of Russell Stovers, but I just thought this was cute because it's in the little gift box. And then we're gonna do a hot cocoa bar here soon. So I bought some Santa hot chocolate bombs. They have all kinds of them right now. So I bought five of these, so that's not part of the basket, but that's one of the finds. So those are kind of cool. Um, get them out of the way. Found these cute little ornaments, little fuzzy ornaments. I thought they were cute. So I picked those up. Picked up some yarn, just some red gingham chuck kind of yarn. There's some projects I'm hoping to get to. I did not get to my fall ones, which I'm sad about, but uh, here, we'll hopefully get to some here soon. We've got some pepper. We are out of pepper, so that's just a household buy. She does not like pepper for her gift basket. <laughs> and here's some cute little wooden ornaments of a truck with a, or a car with a Christmas tree on it. Again, this is like completely random right now. So here's some little beauty items that I got. There are some face masks. She likes face masks and lip scrubs. So I got that Freeman purifying face mask with two sheets in it. Another vitamin C face mask. And then the bubble face mask. I've used, actually used this one. This one's, I like this one. It's pretty good. I haven't used the others yet. And then I got these um, peppermint lip scrub. This would actually be cute in a stocking since it's peppermint. And a hydrating night lip mask. There's some other things in here too. I just haven't. I've got like four bags here. Um, got this basket to put everything in for the birthday um, thing. And birthday basket. And when it's done, I will show you. I'll put a picture at the end. And some more treats. We've got these, um, like taki, the Fiera's chili and lime, like the other crunchy ones out there. She likes those. Those are pretty good. These are my Pop Daddy pretzels in cinnamon sugar. So I thought those might be good. Have to try those. These are another one of her favorite treats. It's hot wing buffalo pretzel pieces. So those can go in the basket. And I found these two, these yam snacks. They had different flavors. I picked the nutty chia pet. So it's got pecans, black sesame, and chia seeds. And got her these Godiva chocolate domes. If you haven't tried these, they are yummy. And so nice. This would be a nice stocking stuffer too. So all this stuff would be good stocking stuffers or um, 
to do Gigi treats in our stocking too. What kind of things do you use in your stocking? Um, pick them down. I'd love to hear your ideas too. We used to do toys and stuff when they were littler and as they got older, we're starting to do more of their favorite treats that they don't get all the time. So here's another one too that's pretty good. These Zaps potato chips and Voodoo Heat. And here's the other... Oh no, I got another night mask for me. <laughs> we got a Mango Nectar Humex drink. So we trade those with a cute little squirrel on the front. And let's see, we got some... Let's see, here's a few things here. Here's some more masks. I got one for her and one for myself. Way to Skin Relaxing Skin Calming Essence Mask. So we got two of those. And then I got some crochet hooks. I thought I'd try these. It's a pretty thin plastic. I'm not sure how they glide with yarn. Let me know what you think. They had a 4.0, 4.5, six and a 6.5 you get two in a pack have you used these uh, we, i usually use metal ones i have not tried these yet we used to have some plastic ones a long time ago but they were smoother than these these, these have some places i don't know um they're not too bad but they're not as smooth as some plastic ones i've had in the past if you use these um, let me know what you think of them but i thought i'd get those for us to try and I got her some of these cute little puzzle books. This is a word search. I just like the way they look. They were different. And they usually have these on a coffee table and she'll do them sometimes. So I thought it might be fun for her to use these. But there's some different word searches. And then a crossword puzzle one. So it's kind of nice. Again, some nice stocking stuffers too. And I like this notebook and oh no I didn't see that it was a little boo-boo on that side but it's kind of a leather bound um, blank pages for gold so if you see that around that's a nice little thing little journaling type book and got some more treats here Let's see some Mrs. Fields cookies some of these biscolata mood cookies on the go in a cup. Those are cute. Got sweet pickles. She likes sweet pickles. I will put, yeah, but she doesn't always get them. So got those for her. This was new. I haven't seen this before. Reese's peanut butter flavored cupcakes. And she likes Reese's, so I'll try those. She'll try those with us. And a tasty baked honey bun. And let's see, some Chips Ahoy cookies. And I got these two drinks. These are really good. They're, if you haven't tried them, they're Agua Frescas. And they had it in strawberry and mango. And they're by Minute Maid. These are really, really good. They usually have them in the front fr fridge cases. Let's see, I think we're down to one more bag before the yarn. Um, we have some, we needed some plastic forks, so I got those. We said we for some pipe cleaners, so. Got in some pipe cleaners, like some different little figures and things out of them, so it's kind of cool. I think I have these. Yeah, we're getting into the craft and toy stuff. I think I have these, but I didn't not didn't want to not buy them since they had a bunch of them tonight. So I got some of the pom poms in red, white, and green. <laughs> I got these cute little gingerbread foams. I'm gonna get some white puffy paint and make them look like iced gingerbread men to put on my cabinet so stay tuned for that i'm going to try to do that in the next couple days and then we picked up 
Um, my son wanted some of these crayons for art stuff, I think, and one of these Zuru Smashers. This is a good deal. This is a name brand, and they have them for stocking. Good stocking stuff are for Christmas. Got this cute little fuzzy ornament to go with the round ornaments. Okay, and then let's say grab these. These are good stocking stuffers. I'm gonna do a little gift basket with these. Um, the Doves Men Care and the Nourishing Cream. These are nice for the winter. And now, I think we're in this, this gigantic bag of yarn. I got doubles of everything, so I'll just... Oh, the son needed a Santa hat. I <laughs> got a Santa hat for him for his holiday show this week. And back to the yarn, I got two skeins of each one. So I will just show the different colors here. So there's the eyelash yarn. I think there was a red too. So there's a cream color, a gray, a blue. And yes, we had a red. So we got those, two skeins of those each. And then the chenille. There's the letter the chenille. There's the pink. The orange. I actually made a pumpkin out of this orange. Um, check my shorts. I think I put it on the shorts. If you want to see that. I made a pumpkin out of that. It came out so cute. And it's really soft. I actually have a swatch here of the of that one. It's just it's really soft. This is nice to make even a, a scarf or something out of it. It's just it's so soft. The way it feels. And black. It's excited about that color. Gray. Let's see what else? Oh. It's another eyelash in green. And then I'm going to make something for the holidays with this one. Um, does this look brown to you, like a reindeer brown? You tell me. We were looking at it back and forth. Sometimes it looks like a dusty rose, and sometimes it looks like a beige or a brown. Um, let me know what you think, and I'll show you what I'm going to make out of that. And that is it. So I'm going to put the basket together with the things that are for her, and I will put a picture at the end of this so you can see it. And we got a couple of um, birthday balloons, too, that are floating above me. So you'll see that in the picture. Uh, thanks again for watching. I know this was kind of a fast one. Missed, missed bringing hauls to you. I do have a Tamu order. Actually, I have a couple two Tamu order, orders. Tamu order. Tamu orders that um, I want to record and share this week, too. So stay tuned for that. I want to thank you so much for watching and please um, like and subscribe if you have not already. Would love to have your support. Um, helps my channel grow and it's been growing so I really do thank you. I appreciate you all very much even though I had the pause it's still been growing and I really appreciate that. Um, hoping to make some more content here for you and start showing you some craft content too because I've got a bunch of craft stuff um, just waiting in the wings <laughs> to do. And can't wait to share that with you too. Again, it's Carmen with um, a little time out for me. And thank you so much. Hope you're having a great week and we'll see you soon. Bye.